the last walk to the... <gasps> oh no! We don't get our driver! It's sad! <laughs> this is us happy leaving at... Well, our bus leaves at 7.15, so we have to be up at 6. But we're just waiting, so... This is us. This is Haley. So happy to be here. Yeah, we're... It's painful. But we're probably not going to be able to sleep on the shuttle because it's going to be... And yes, it is a shuttle. It's not the naked bus. It's the naked shuttle. The naked shuttle. Which will be explained in detail. I promise you that. In transit. <laughs> just out the window. It gets car sick. Just <laughs> Yeah, I know. It's, it's all twisty turvy curvy and then we got a serial killer bus driver too on the way up but um yeah we'll definitely be filming more in Picton I'm sure but this is the end of the journey and I wanted to mark that so yep. this is the last time in the YHA in Machuica. Is that the only time in Machuica home? No. No. Yeah we got the kitchen. Yeah. We didn't get the bathroom. You didn't get the it's okay, you're not missing much. It's a scary place. Well, yeah. It's a really scary place. Yeah, especially in the dark, so. Anyway, um, we'll see you a little later. Say goodbye to Baker's Lodge. Bye, Baker's Lodge. And. Bye, Tooth. We didn't say oh, goodbye yeah. to Tooth. We left Tooth. Um. Yeah. We said bye to Ghosty though. And we are off to Nelson. There's not any water in there. Okay, this is officially the end of the journey. We're on the ferry. We're going home. We're going home. We're going to Wellington. We would appear more excited, but we're too exhausted to do anything but sit here. We're so, we're just like cranky and irritated and tired and. We're over it. I have to say. We're over picked in. We're, yeah. We're done with picked in. Agreed. So, yeah. We're on the ferry and. We're not happy. Well, actually, we are no. happy. No, we're happy. Yeah. We've got three hours to go. We're kind of happy. It's, it's just three hours. And then Facebook. Now we get to talk to everybody. It doesn't so. seem that bad considering we've been awake since 6 a.m. Yeah. What that's time is it now? Bad too. Yeah. It's been pretty intense, but um, oh no, it was good except for our time we oh, picked in. Uh -huh. But. But you need a code. Um. Yeah. We will. We'll see you in Wellington, I guess. Goodbye. Yeah, it was an amazing trip, but it was really good to come back and to be home and to sleep in my own comfortable bed. That was wonderful. It's amazingly wonderful. It's a lot warmer in here than it was at the hostel in Machuaca, which is really weird, right? Because you think. But no, it, it's just cold everywhere. But ever since I got back, it has been raining and windy. Um, 24-7, except for yesterday, which was really, really nice, and I took advantage of that, and I went for the longest walk, went down to Lyle Bay, and, um, yeah, I just, I just kept walking, because I was like, sunshine! <laughs> so, anyway, um, yeah, and the rest of my break has just been doing things like that, like little walks around. Or, um, you know, my presentation that I have to give on Tuesday or Wednesday, Tuesday, whatever. It's sometime next week and I got to finish it up. But it's cool because it's on live music venues and uh, performances in Wellington. So I get to go out and um, listen to music and stuff and that's been pretty fun. I'm kind of ready to get the assignment over with, though. Um, 
It's a two-month period. We're halfway done, and I just, I can't believe it. Time's really flying. It took me about a month to get into the swing of things here, but now it's home. It is, so it's cool. But it doesn't mean that I don't miss you guys terribly. Like I said a million times during this whole trip and all these videos, I always say it. I miss you. I love you. I cannot wait to get home. One exciting thing I'm really looking forward to here. Um, I have been going out to like study the, the venues and performances and stuff in Wellington. And the music here is it's great if you're into this kind of music, which I like, you know, the stuff back home that you can really dance to, you know, as dad would do. Um, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, they just don't have that here. So I'm really looking forward to getting back and going out one night and just dancing my butt off to music that I have rhythm to. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's going to be fun. So I think, even though I'm exhausted, I will be exhausted when I get back, I'm, like, going to go out. So. <laughs> um, but anyway, yeah, that's that. It's about 4.30 in the afternoon here. Feels a lot later because it's um, raining. Go figure. And, uh, yeah. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed the videos. It kind of gives you a little idea of where I've been and what I was up to. And um, I'll upload them ASAP so you can hopefully enjoy them. Hopefully I have time to watch them. Dad! No, I'm just kidding. I know you're busy. But you should watch them because they're good. And if not, then when I get back, I'm going to have to sit you down and make you watch them. Anyway, um, I love you all, and I miss you so much, and I can't wait to see you, and even though I'm loving it here, I still think about you guys a lot, and, um, yeah, I'm trying to live it up, though, because I know when I get home, I'm not going to get to come back here for a while. I'm going to come back, though. I love it here, but, um, you guys would love it, too. Maybe you come with me next time, but, anyway, okay. I'm done talking. I'll talk to you later.